ingredients to get to know God. Ingredients to get to know God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Hey, welcome to Weed and Barley. This is a place where you get the ingredients to get to know God. I am Maxine. Welcome to day eight. Praise God. This is eight of 21 of our submission fast. I'm so excited that you have joined me this morning. Praise God. As we go into prayer on this word. Hallelujah. So we're moving into uh, 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 verse 11, chapter 19 of Luke. And I'll go ahead and read it. I actually read this parable to us. Praise God. And then I will jump into the meat of things because the title of this message is Jesus is not friendly to his enemies. Praise God. Jesus is not friendly to his enemies. Okay. All right. So starting at verse 11. And while they were listening to these things, he went on to tell a parable because he was near Jerusalem and they supposed that the king kingdom of God was going to appear immediately. He said, therefore, a certain nobleman went to a distant country to receive a kingdom for himself and then return. And he called 10 of his slaves and gave them 10 minas and said to them, do business with this until I come back. But his citizens hated him and sent a delegation after him saying, we do not want this man to reign over us. And it came about that when he returned after receiving the kingdom, he ordered that these slaves to whom he had given the money be called to him in order that he might know what business they had done. And the first appeared saying, master, your mina has made 10 minas more. And he said to him, well done, good slave, because you have been faithful in a very little thing, be in authority over 10 cities. And the second came saying, your mina master has made five minas. And he said to him also, and you are to be over five cities. And another came saying, master, behold your mina, which I kept put away in a handkerchief. For I was afraid of you because you are a, a, an, exacting man you take up what you did not lay down and reap what you did not sow he said to him by your own words i will judge you you worthless slave did you know that i am an exacting man taking up what i did not lay down and reaping what i did not sow then why did you not put the money in the bank and having come i would have collected it with interest and he said to the bystander take the mina away from him and give it to the one who has the ten minas. And they said to him, Master, he has ten minas already. I tell you that to everyone who has sh who has shall more be given. But from the one who does not have, even what he does not have shall be taken away. But these enemies of mine who did not want me to reign over them, bring them here and slay them in my presence. Praise God. The Lord wants me to focus on verse 27 today. Praise God. We will go in and dive into this parable, but today we're focusing on 27. But these enemies of mine who did not want me to reign over them, bring them here and slay them in my presence. Hallelujah. The Lord wants you to know today that his enemies, hallelujah, he, are, he is not friendly with them. Praise God. He is not friendly with his enemies. Hallelujah. And I need for you to understand this. Those who are not for you are against you. Praise God. This is biblical. Those who are not for Jesus, they're against him. The Lord said his enemies are our enemies and our enemies are his enemies. Praise God. Hallelujah. But guess what? He will contend with those who contend with us because let's pray. Dear Father God, thank you for day eight. Hallelujah. We're so glad to be together in your presence, Father God. We're so glad to be under your leadership, oh Lord Jesus. Thank you for this day. Strengthen us, guide us in all of our ways, Lord God, as we consecrate to you, as we continue to pray and meditate on the word. We love you and we honor you. Hallelujah. Show us the way. Order our steps today, oh Father God. May we not miss anything that you have for us in the mighty name of Jesus. Cover our families, cover our territories and properties, oh Lord God. Hallelujah. Send the angels who have charge over us to protect us, hallelujah, and to minister to us today, Lord God, giving us exactly what we need, hallelujah. May we have ears to hear them in Jesus' mighty name. We love you, O Lord God. Continue to have your hand on our shoulders as you help us through this freedom, O Lord, hallelujah, through the Holy Spirit. We're so grateful, O Lord God, to be in the body of Christ. We thank you, we honor you, and we glorify you today. In Jesus' mighty name we pray, amen. I pray that each and every one of you are blessed today, that you're moving in day eight. 
with grace, hallelujah, that you are doing what the, God, that the Lord has called you to do, which is to eat right, y'all, to consecrate, to pray, to meditate on the word, read the word, spend some time with the Lord and see what the Lord is saying to you. I will see you back at 6 p.m. Praise God and remember Jesus said, hallelujah, that he is not friendly with his enemies. Praise God. Hallelujah. To get to know God. Ingredients. To get to know God. Ingredients. To get to know God. Ingredients. To get to know